you bitches and bros and not binary hoes. It is me, Sharita. I'm going to back up a little bit more. I'm back again to do a mini haul. Also, a life update at the end. Um, also, a little mini haul. And we are going to do Blue Lock. We are. Because two, ep two episodes have passed. So, I've been starting to collect these mini um, keychains. And for a while, I had... You can't really see. I've had. Can you see them? Yeah, you can. I had. Um, I think this is Obito, Marta, Marta, Obito. I had Obito from um, Five Below, and then I got the one from. Um, I don't know who this is. Just to let you know, I don't know who this man is. I never seen this man a day in my life. Let's move in a little closer. I haven't met this man. Look. I don't know who this man is. Can you see him? A day in my life. I haven't met him. I don't know who this man is. I know he's in Spy Family. That's what I got. And then today, I went to Buy Below. And I, my purpose was to go and find some, um, some drawer organizers. Because I don't really have space on my desk. So, but... I might have to start over because I forgot I didn't have audio on. That's that's on me. Hey, bitches and bros, not by dairy hoes. It's me, sure you also know the Isles. I have some some little things to show you. So I went. I have a the mini haul. Then we do life update, and then we're going to do um, possibly, maybe I'm going to do um, a read through of. Blue Lock. Almost a fuck over now. So, for a while I had a little Obito keychain. I had Obito. And for a while I had him. Can I move it like that? Is it better? Maybe not. <laughs> Let me move this this way. Maybe that's better. So, I had a little Obito. And for a while I had him. And I was okay with that. Because I was okay with Obito. It's fine. I was okay with him. And then I got today um, from a spy family. I don't know who this is. I never met this man a day in my life. But he could be his daddy if he wanted to. If he was really hot, daddy. I don't know. Let me know if his voice is hot. Maybe. Just, you know, maybe. I don't know why. Okay. We might have to figure out the lighting. Because I can't really show And then today. I was going there for the purpose of getting some drawers. Um... Some drawer organizers organized because I don't really have space on my desk. And then I wanted to also see if they have any more like Naruto, like any of my faves. If I could get Shikamaru, if I can get like Kashi, anything like that. But I, as I was opening it, I was like, I hope I get Gara. I got my man. Oh, he's a little spiky. He kind of hurt a little bit. But I got my man. I got him when he's like probably 18. Legal. <laughs> legal age. Not an adult. But like this is teenage girl. <sighs> this is my man. This is the version of him. Also Shubin that I enjoyed and loved. This is my man. I hate what they did to him in Boruto because one, he doesn't have his shishin. He doesn't have his Jujutsu Ki is fine. I don't care about that. But also, he's a dad now. I love that. But his hair is so ugly. But until that episode when, like, it got wet and then he got hot again. So, <laughs> I might do a reaction on that. I kind of like had, like, a chip look. He looks so done. I just love him. My mom looks at him and he says, that girl? No, this is a man. He's a man. So, yeah, let me go put him back. And my... Keychain. I'm gonna put the back in the keychain. Keychain, yeah. Okay. And then we went to the thrift store because they had a they had a half price sale on the, in the thrift store, Goodwill. And I bought some books and bought some movies. So the first book is about a witch, like witch hunting, some about witches. And I'm really, like, I've been wanting to read more historical f fiction. And this is a historical fiction book. And 
probably going to take me long. I'm going to read it in winter time. Winter time, I'm going to be reading it because she had more booba than me. I do love her dress. I love that. I, maybe because it's red, and my favorite color is red. That's why I picked it. Um, it has something to do with like probably enemies to lovers, witches. Um, something about like uh, can be tamed, very fiery, spicy, and trying to. I'm an asexual. But I've been trying to branch out a little bit. Just a little just a little bit. Not a lot of it. Just a little bit. To just like deal with smut. Because it's not gonna be an everyday thing. And then I got From My Lady's Heart, and this is like a night by Laura Kinsale. Sorry, this is um So Enchanting by Connie Brockway. So Enchanted by Kathy Brockway and Lori. Um, this is a special edition. And this is something something to do with night. Something something to do with like mystery. I don't know. But I got it because it's a cover. And I'm possibly going to read it in the winter time. Let you know. And then I got Dead Until Dark by Charlene Harris. Which is the True Blood. First book in the True Blood series. And Sucky Silk House, Stack, Stack House, Vampires, Blood, Witches, all that stuff. Bill, Vampires, something like that. Spice, I'm trying to like get the series so I can read up on the series. Get more into like spicy vampire stuff. So I've been wanting to read this and eventually I will watch the show. Eventually, who knows. And then another thing I've been wanting to read but also watch... Outlander by Diana Gabaldon. 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 Yeah, I've been meaning to read her. And this is a historical fantasy romance. Because she goes back in time. And she was like, I think she was a war nurse. And then she goes back in time when she actually touches a pillar into like Scotland. Uh, Sassafas. You know, stuff like that. So yeah, those are the books. On to the movies. So, I'm a movie girl. It's been a while since I sat and watched a movie and enjoyed it and like did feelings and stuff about it. I have all these movies. Let me, ooh, don't fall, please, God. So I got Paranormal Activity. What happens when you sleep a lot? So I've been meaning to watch paranormal, paranormal, paranormal Activity. Um, I know there's like a trilogy and stuff. I know there's another movie coming out, I think. I think I saw there was another movie coming out. So, plan on watching it. Don't know when. It's like a found footage. Scary shit, so. Into it. Then we have Mamma Mia, the movie. I've never seen Mamma Mia, so I got it because I've never seen it. And it's like a musical. I know some people, just two men are gay, um, and one of them was her dad. Yeah, I'm into it. And I think Meryl Streep is in this, so yes, Meryl Streep. I'm Legend. I've seen this movie once, and I want to have it. I think they're like, they have superpowers. They're like, um, the heroes have powers and like war and shit. I don't know about it. But. I've never watched it, like it. Then I got. Um, I remember having the movie at one point, and I think we got rid of it or broke, and that is Breaking Dawn Part Two. I've been meaning to get Part Two for myself personally because that's the only movie I liked. I they did have Twilight, they did have New Moon. I did not see them have Eclipse. I could have got all of them, but I only wanted to have this. Because I remember, I was in that theater, having the time of my life, and then a certain thing happened. And I went crazy and feral, so. And I got Harry Potter and the Order of the Phoenix, because I've been trying to stack up my Harry Potter movies. And I remember watching it, reading it in Order of the Phoenix. I know this is when, um... Umbridge comes and all this stuff and we learn more about the War of the Phoenix. Yeah. 
Hushna and I got a medieval movie that I haven't had, which is maybe a Christmas play. And his his movies when there's plays follow a formula, which I'm okay with because it's short. It's Medea goes crazy, life lesson, gospel music, preaching, all that stuff. And it's, it's a good time. And then I got, I almost done, I promise. And the Prisoner of Azkaban, Harry Potter and the Prisoner of Azkaban. Um, yeah, 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 yeah. I've been meaning to, I've been meaning to re watch this movie. Um, this is when time magic becomes a thing. This is when we see Remus and him. Yeah. And then I also got Scott Pilgrim vs. The World. I've never seen this movie. I've heard about this movie. I'm interested in this movie. So yes. Whew. I've, I've, I've taste. I'm, I've taste when it comes to movies. So life. Life has been okay. It's been fine, I guess. Um, I can't complain. I thought I had to get a new laptop. Hey. But I factory restarted it because it just kept popping up shit. It kept popping up weird shit. It kept going slow. And it just, like, I had a lot of stuff. And I worried about, like, having to start over with this book I've been writing. But I didn't have to start over. And then I wrote some chapters today that I really, really liked. And I had a good time. And I got emotional because of my ship. And my couple is like, it was a good time. It was a good time. Um, medicine, medicine, medical life has been good. I have a, have a dentist appointment coming up. I have to get an MRI done on my ear next month. Other than that, Fine. I have a doctor's appointment coming in November soon. Uh, reading. Reading has been really good because I've been rereading. Um, I've been rereading The Hanged Man by Katie Edwards. Katie, you can go get my ass because the tower ain't dead. I just let you. I'm, as I spoiled you. He's a certain character. Is not. You know what? Because he's not. Because who's going to walk? Broom down the aisle. It's sure as fuck not gonna be Bran because Bran's gonna be his fucking best man. It's not going to be Max because Max is going to be the flower girl or the ring bearer. Because that's not gonna happen. They're gonna get emotional for the camera. It's not gonna happen, but I've been enjoying myself, like seeing his progression and Adam, and like maybe that's why I'm reading it. Maybe I just wanted to feel good and just not cry for once. Because I was in a motherfucking slump. If you're gonna talk about reading, um, manga. I've been reading manga, I guess. Anime has been good. I've been watching some anime, but like I haven't had the energy to sit in front of this camera and just pretend I have energy because half the time. I'm the fucking exhausted. <laughs> the other time, I don't even know where I am. <laughs> um, reading, writing, TV shows. I don't really watch any TV shows, any movies. That's why I bought all the movies so I can watch movies. Um, again, you have to have energy to sit up and watch shit and do shit. So, mm. uh, D and D. Uh, I had a fun game Monday. The game was good. I game Monday. Uh, Thursday I'm supposed to have a game. I'm supposed to be DMing a game. I don't know if they're going to show up though, so. Um, Sundays I'm starting to have a game. I'm going to be playing a sorcerer who's like a teacher. <laughs> a sorcerer who's a teacher who's very great and I've been wanting to play a sorcerer. She's a high elf. Um, other than that, things are great, so let's, let's do this. Hey guys, so mini update plus haul plus me reading Blue Lock 231 and 232. Let's go. Um, which is called Dive to Blue. As we enter the gr game's final stages between Bastion Munchen Machine and Ubers, the game is tied to two. Then you'll let that happen for long. 
With both masters out of the game, the game reverts to total unpredictability. As the game climaxes, it's up to the equalist on the field to lead their team to victory. As tensions run high and the anticipation builds, the players eagerly wait for the game to restart. Yes. Since Baru had tried this play, this play played through him. His this team played through him this. Using the tactics I taught you, show me a goal that I couldn't have come up with. Roger, just keep doing what we've been doing, copy that. Yoshi, 100% focus. What the fuck? What the fuck? I just love how my skin's kind of glowing, when in reality, it's not. It's just damaged. You shot Shank. You shall sanction this team to do your bidding, Baru. If we lose, you better take responsibility. Got that, you unruly brat? <sighs> Shut up, you goddamn dinosaur. Just sit quietly on the bench and tremble in fear as you watch me surpass you. What is wrong with me? Did I like that? <laughs> you know I do. You know I do. It's something on my teeth. Ugh. No, it's just the fucking lighting. <laughs> Such big words. Better back it up with the wind, you shitty brats. Shashura! Hmm. I will win. What the fuck is I'm gonna say? Karo Jin, I promise I'll play you in the next match. Until then, stay ready. Yes, Master. He's kinda hot. I'm sorry. Yusuke Kun, thanks for picking me. I didn't do it for you. It's just that I need your ability to score. That's all there is to it. Yuri, you can use Metavision, right? Yeah. That for vision thing you mentioned before, right? That's right. Miss Nuffy stopped my counterattack. What did you see? Oh, that. You would have scored if you had got the ball at your feet. <laughs> Looks like we're on the same page. I need your level-headed analytical playmaking. Yeah, but we can't fault. You, you might have come for sending that lob pass. Thanks to Yumikiya's Kun's dribbling, you created the space needs to score. So, what's the plan? Don't have one. <laughs> I can't believe you. Demanded no to pick me with that kind of bravado. It's not like I had some other choice. Ubers also made their substitutions. We'll probably have to you dub and improvise on fly. But since those guys are still evolving, there's bound to be some gaps. If we can be on the same page and exploit those gaps, we'll 100% win. So... What we need is a collaborative winning vision, where we both read and analyze the game with the meta vision. Got it. Why do I just feel like he's a he's a different version of Nagi than I've seen? Because he's 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 on a different level. He's on a different level. I hate that. I hate. I don't hate the expectation that Easy Deton has for me. Let's do this, Yuri. I'm definitely going to change during this match. I can feel it. Okay, Equest. I'm surprised, Snuffy, to think you would resort to such emotional tactics. Talking shit off the- They're talking shit off the fucking gate. Did you get all the soft due to those brats' enthusiasm and passion? Can it, you emotionless cyborg? Isuki Yoshi, I can see why you took him as your protege. He's got a unique talent. I could say the same to your protege. Baruchei's potential as a striker is up there with the best U20 strikers in the world. Right. Heck, when I see those two go at it, they remind you me of me of you and Ego. Jibachi, why is it so fucking small? That twisted rivalry you two had. Don't lump me with together with him. 
I want to see more involved. I want to see more involved players than that twisted maniac. <laughs> I forgot that Pachi was a player and that they were like teammates. <laughs> huh. But if those two continue to evolve at this rate, that pipe dream of Japan someday winning the World Cup might turn into reality. Crap, 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 crap. And Kiza, Kiza Kaiser's like, look, <laughs> I'm not doing what I need to do, and you're not doing what you need to do. Just contain Yoshi's already a pain in the ass, but on top of that, we've got to deal with Uber's unpredictable tactics. There's a chance that Kaiser and I might lose. What's wrong, Ness? <laughs> What's with that pathetic look on your face? If you keep looking like that, even the goddess of victory, victory will abandon you. Okay. <laughs> okay. K Kaiser, but what should we do? Just stay calm. Every game has gaps that we can exploit. Yoshi will definitely try to out with that shitty, hot-headed, redhead gorilla. He has red hair. I thought it was pro. <laughs> we'll target that. We'll destroy them all, Ness. Are you ready? I... <laughs> Why am I like this? Because, like, it's it's a shot in the dark between Kaiser, Kab K K Kagami, and fucking Baru. All three of them can do whatever they want. Baru-chan, you can have one of my duo teeth. Ugh. Get your disgusting teeth out of my face before I knock them out, asshole. <laughs> I've never seen Snuffy make that face before. I'm indebted to you, man, okay? In that case, you all better set me up for the winning goal, okay? Okay, okay. Okay, kid. Damn it, next time. Next time, definitely, I'll stop it. Yeah. Fuck appearances. I'm... I'm this game's hero. Honey, you haven't done anything! Ugh. You bastards be ready to go. You hear me? Now the snuffy gone. It's time to shift the game back in our focus. I'm doing this because it's small. As I just said, after a forced back and forth battle with sensational goals, that's how we went through this. That's how we went with it. This is. Emerge as this game's protagonist, have all the pieces, to score and become the hero. Okay. I'll take full advantage of Hiroi's playmaking abilities and dominate this game. Fasten your seatbelts. Uh, okay. The final restart. Like, this is the final restart. It better be. We've been in this fucking match for ages. Uh, uh, excuse me. The last goal is mine, so this is final kickoff. The king of this match is me. So an ad is about to play, and it's like, listen, I just don't care at this point who wins. Just let it be over. It shouldn't be this long for these fucking matches go on for ages. It shouldn't be this long where I have to, like, wait months weeks to just have a batch to just to read to you i don't at this point i don't care who wins i'm rooting for everybody because he loses borrow wins he went he loses borrow wins he lo he wins uh fucking kaiser wins so iski just feels too much like he he is the main character but baby is he really <laughs> Oh, is he really? Also, we're getting a uh, we're getting a Nagi's movie with his like manga. So we're getting a manga. We're getting a movie over about Ma Nagi's movie. So that's interesting. That's that's interesting. We're getting a season two as well. So yeah, the command spring. Of next year. High evolution. Okay. So that must mean more content is coming out, right? 
to this. Since Hiryori possesses Metavision, Isuki believes Hiryori is the last piece to the puzzle as the game restarts. Kaiser gets the first cat crack at scoring the winning goal, who will ultimately become the game's hero. Show me what you got. And then Baru gets into his face. You blue rose tattooed freak. Looks like you need to be taken down a peg, you red-headed gorilla. Eh, the sky's pressing. He never did that until now. If that's the case, my job is to lure them in. Oh, oh shit, okay. Trap him. He pointed to his ass. Attaboy, ass, attaboy. Yes, success. Vroom. Did he go, vroom? Is that what, bitch, are you serious? Did he have metaphysics? Because his eyes went vroom. What the fuck does that mean? Leave the rest to me. I think we established that he has metaphysics. Let me know. Huh? He's attacking straight up the, the middle? Watch out, Kaiser's coming. Don't let him shoot. Watch the flanks. Kaiser, find it. I only need I only need a ball's width of space. Aim for it. Yoshi's over there. I'll force it open. Kaiser impact. Instant kill. Goon. Oh. Lightning strike. Oh. Oh. It's that man. Uh. Jesus. Uh. Ooh. Yoho. Lorenzo. Yeah, it's your man. He ain't gonna let you leave, boo. Second ball. With an expectations, run. Get to the ball first. If I can get to it, I have a huge chance. I can reach direct. Oh. Ow. <laughs> he did a snake move, bitch. You don't even see what's that. Isuki. Isuki. Maybe you should, like, look at her. Like, that's what I'm like, look at the person that you brought into this game to help you. Because right now, you're getting fucked on all sides. You're not the only one with that ability, little robber. <laughs> the annoying son of a... Yeah, everyone in this field has a benefiction. Right back at ya. We're seeing this. We're seeing the game just fine. Nice, Yuri. Too naive. Oh. Oh! You bench-warming scrub. Fuck. What the? Barokan? To think the king himself will help out on defense. Nico, Nico's like, I'm done. <laughs> this mean, this makes our jobs a hell of a lot easier. Such a pleasant working environment. Bonsai? <laughs> Bonsai! Responding <laughs> to Barokan's press with their coordinated press? Shit, this is bad. You're getting ganged up on, son. For real, for real. Like, it's... <laughs> I can't believe Barra willingly decided to do the dirty work and play defense from the front. He had no choice because he saw you. He... Th <laughs> that was un... Thank you. That was unthinkable until now. Now that, now that we must account for that, our decision making will be one step slower. On the other hand, those guys simply have to play off Baru and just their attacks as accordingly. Ow. But Baru's loyalty is only to himself. You said, baby boy. A perfect union where a king combines forces with his mouth, flawlessly designed army, allowing him to pursue his goals. What are you guys, some frickin' ch chimera? Feeding on Baru's ego and ideals, Ubers right now are cur currently undergoing an explosive evolution. Shut up, let's go. But they're on high alert for you, nut, double nub, nutmeg shot. What would you like us to do, your royal highness? Oopus are totally hilarious right now. So, Barbara Chan, what will you do? Shut up and work. I'm wrapping up my hat trick with a gozol. The fuck does that mean? You're just saying shit now, babe. Using the needle Equus League, I'm gonna show the world that I'm the best player in the world. Said world twice now. 
Damn it, this is a different level. Ubers are so freaking amazing. They're too fast, too good, I can't read them. <clears throat> I haven't gotten to the game at all. So this is the world stage. Are you telling me izuki has been constantly aiming for the goal, fighting all these monsters, even Kaiser and Barukan? How did those guys score goals at this level? Everyone out here is a twisted psycho. What is this place? I fucking love it. <laughs> okay, Harry. All right. Oh, okay. After seeing seconds after stepping into the pitch, he just went demon mode. He just went demon mode, my guy. He ain't a girl. Uh-uh. <laughs> After sex and after stepping onto the pitch, he experiences the intensity that emanates from the world stage. As the egoist in him overalls and delight, Hiryu gets into the game, ready to carve out a new destiny. Come, Hiyori, come! <laughs> come, Guinevieve, to me. If you get the reference, I love you. This is the first time I've experienced this type of football. Oh, Yes. Oh, yes. I can't wait to this kid. I can't. He looks so fucking good. I, I'm afraid to show you so I don't get copy. He look, that looks so good. That looks so good. And that's, and that's it. And that's it. I don't never, I never know what to say. Because it's been three days and I never know what to say, but I will see you guys again another time.